All right, hey everyone, this is Jack, and welcome to your day trading free video. Uh, in the left hand chart here, we have a Fibonacci extension down to the existing 618 at 13,858. The reason why I'm pointing this out is because we've kind of held this as support uh, for a while now. Uh, and also Google and there's a lot of other charts in big tech like NVIDIA they all kind of look like this where they have this quadruple bottom um, you know I drew too many boxes there but you know a, a lot of support here on Google at this area um, right right above 2520 NVIDIA is a little more interesting just because it's the same looking chart but you have a tree line right here uh, and I've been trading NVIDIA for a long time. It, it doesn't really like to um, stay below 210 for very long. So we're 212, 215 kind of area. Uh, and there's really no smaller time frame scale that I like, except for the hourly that has a squeeze on the downtrend here. So what I'm looking for on Monday after the long weekend is one last flush just to see if that makes sense because it makes sense for me to see the NASDAQ down a little bit more uh, and then maybe we can start um, some bullish positions that's what I'm looking forward to do next week uh, so I was looking at um, Tesla and Nvidia Tesla has earnings coming up on Wednesday uh, and then we'll have things like meta and all the big tech names uh, reporting in the following uh, week as well so it's a big next two weeks should be very volatile and what I'm trying to do is play the reversal on a lot of names that have really gotten beat up things like Nvidia and Tesla uh, which are two of my favorite names to trade uh, so that's what I'm looking for uh, the tail end of this video it's pretty short and sweet uh, gold is an interesting spot because the two hour the one hour and basically every time frame worth mentioning uh, is squeezing right now and there's even a high compression on the two hour time frame so what does all this mean well right here if we pull back a little right there to the re reversion to the mean on the downtrend it's created kind of a more high compression situation you have a ready and fire major buy signal by the way um, I changed my settings to major buy and sell so if the arrows up you've got the ready bar I'm looking for this to start trucking higher which are just, may not be good for equities so maybe it's you know definitely feels like a coin toss uh, whenever you're talking about being long or short the Nasdaq going into Monday so we'll see how it all pans out but just keep your eye on gold uh, I think you know if you're buying your leap options right now your long calls or you know your your fall positions uh, you know, you do it now before it hits 2,000 on gold, um, especially, you know, before uh, these compressions here fire. Um, keep in mind, you do have a monthly squeeze on gold right now that could take into 2023 or later uh, to even, you know, come to fruition. So honestly, I think it's a good long-term situation to be involved with gold to the long side. Um, and uh, those are my thoughts heading into the long weekend. Uh, we're just going to have to see what happens here with this NASDAQ. If nothing can hold up on Monday, it might get really nasty. It might get, we could really revisit the, um, you know, last month's lows, you know, go all the way back down to where we came from in mid-March and see what happens from there. So um, it's a tough call, long or short on the long haul uh, in, a, in a larger duration of time. Um, but earnings coming up, we'll have to see, you know, how, you know Tesla reacts of course that's gonna be a big deal and uh, just you know move with the water you know we'll have to see what happens but um, kinda of tough to call it here uh, right before the the long weekend but we'll see what happens on Monday I'm gonna come in see if it makes sense see if we can buy this heading into those earnings so have a great weekend and we'll see you in the next one thanks for watching this video if you've enjoyed the video be sure to like and comment down below to help us out also, be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon so you can get notified when we release our next video. And if you want to watch us trade in real time using our own money, go to simplertrading.com to learn how to sign up. Good trading, and we'll see you in the next video.